Whether you're on iPhone or Android, there's a ton of different thumbnail maker apps out there. And I've actually gone through a lot of these and I've narrowed down the best selection of apps to help you make amazing YouTube thumbnails. And when it comes down to it, there's really only two options that you should be considering. And the first one is Canva. And the reason why is this is one of the best graphic design apps out there. It's available on iPhone and Android. It's completely free. There is a paid version that you can get, but it's not required. There's no watermark. You get a ton of features and overall it's just the most useful for brand new beginners. Now the only downside is they do have a lot of bad thumbnail templates in there. A lot of things that don't follow the best practices. Like they even have thumbnail templates in there that have subscribe buttons on them. Like you can't even subscribe to someone from the thumbnail template. Like why did they make that? I don't know. So I don't recommend people to use those templates. I've actually gone ahead and made a free thumbnail template pack for you guys that can be used in Canva. Easily just drag yourself in. You can adjust the tags, add different things in, but it's already pre-done for you. I also have some backgrounds in there too if you do want to build a thumbnail from scratch but it's completely free if you want to click the link down below uh, you can add it right to your Canva account and then those are yours to use on your channel. But yeah, outside of their weird templates, you know, you can add stickers, you can add text, you can do other effects, definitely worth using. And then option number two that I have on here is to use your own video editor to make thumbnails. And the reason why you may want to choose that is because you may be more comfortable with your video editor. You're better at adding text and different things in versus having to learn a completely new software. Not that Canva is complex, but still, it's like you're wearing so many hats as a creator. You're trying to get comfortable on camera and video edit and, you know, lighting and all these different things. So if it's easier just to make the thumbnail in your video editor and it works and this can work for anything. You can make a thumbnail in CapCut, InShot, uh, PowerDirector, any other editor. And the way you can do this is once you create, you know, a thumbnail or still image in one of these apps, you can just screenshot on your phone. Like literally you can click the power button and volume up on iPhone screenshot should be pretty similar on Android. Some button combination allow you to take a screenshot on your phone. And then you can go into the photo editor that's just built into your phone and do a crop in and just make a crop in box around the thumbnail because it's 16 by nine and it'll, you'll be able to use it on YouTube and doing that surprisingly works really well. So whether you want to go the Canva route, utilize some of my templates or just use your video editor, both of those apps are really great option. However, whichever route you go, you're going to want to avoid the common mistakes beginners make with making thumbnails and I actually put together this video here to help you avoid those mistakes and what you should actually be doing to make good thumbnails. So definitely head here next.